Hello everyone, welcome to your favorite YouTube channel, my project ideas. Today we are going to make a C++ project on the topic Telephone Directory Management System. Let's see the requirements. First an IDE will be required, a text editor will be required and an operating system will be required. Now let's go to VS Code and let's see what does this code have for us. Okay. First all the header files are included. Then we have a class name directory which has certain attributes for the students or for the students, for the teachers, for various kind of people, for normal people, because it's a telephone directory. Then, we have to enter the password to get into it. So, it says us to enter the password. So, we have to get in touch what the password actually is. So, whatever we are going to do, we are going to have it on accounts to directory. If the username will already be exist, will already exist, then it says, sorry, try a new one. Then for sign in, what you have to do is your username will be admin and your um, what you can say your passcode will also be admin. So this will be sign in, and uh, the password will be we did not get the password till now, right? Okay. So what will be our password? Admin will be this, and the passcode is this get password, right? So there will be a function called get password. So then, for sign up, what we are going to do is here we have to enter. Uh, you have you have to enter your username and you have to enter a password. Then to get details, you have to enter the first name, the last name, and the phone number. You need to enter so that it will be shown on the telephone directory. Then search and display. So basically, you have to search for a particular person and you can display its details as well. And if the file is unable to be opened, it says unable to open file. And if it is not, then it says sorry not. This is a delete function. If you want to delete something, you can delete it. Again, it will be stored in the temp.directory file. Because sometimes you may need to have get in touch with those files in the future. Then this is a modification. If you want to modify the existing telephone directory. Then you can enter the first name of the record which you want to modify and the last name of the record which you want to modify. If the record doesn't is not found, it says sorry, record not found. This is the main function. Here it asks you to sign in or sign up first. And if the password will be root, okay, admin and root. So if the password will be incorrect, it says sorry, the password is incorrect. Now let me run it. In the terminal, I'm running the code for you. So what I am going to do is sign in to an existing account. My and this is ADMI. Password is ROOT. Signed in. What I will do, I will enter new directories. First name is Tonal. Last name is Pathak. Phone number. Got it. No. Yes. First name is Sahil. Sand. Phone number. No. No. Okay. So, let me view existing directories. So, the file which we have. We need to go there and we need to save it, okay? Uh, see, this is what we have. So now we'll run this again and I'll show you the other functionalities. Let it load. Huh? So you got it to know the first second, first one. If I go to second. So now let's run again because I created my own account as well. Now what we are going to do, we are going to again go to the uh, file, okay, sign in, 
my username was admin. This was root. So my username was this. So now what we are going to do, we are going to log out and exit. So I hope you understood the working of this code. For more interesting project ideas, stay tuned to our channel. Thank you and have a great day. Thank you.